500,000 state and local government jobs have been lost since 2007, and 30,000 federal employees were let go in 2011. And now the Postal Service is on track to cut 35,000 jobs by February 2013. As we all know, the GOP has been demanding a cuts-only approach to balancing the federal budget. This approach would entail approximately a 40% reduction of the budget. What effect would this have on federal jobs? With 5 million employees on the federal payroll, this would translate into approximately 2 million red slips. And the tax cuts the GOP is pushing for would necessitate even more job cuts. And worse still, they want to make even further cutbacks at the state and local levels. The bottom line is, cutting down the size of government can result in layoffs and or heavy pay reductions. As they have often stated, this is a key component to their jobs plan. The so-called jobs plan will result in massive layoffs. The notion that unemployment is job creation is very Orwellian to say the least. Bye.